What up, everybody? It's your boy SGFL, man, and we are back with another video. You dig? I'm humbled, man, because I'm always happy when I get new artists reaching out and want me to check out their music, all right? It always humbles me because I appreciate the opportunity. I'm always down to hear new music. You know, we're a big palette on this channel of just all um, spectrums of music. So uh, I was hit up by Meyer, all right? Meyer. On her, it says Ed Meyer, but I'm going to go off what it says here. It says Meyer, all right? He's like, I got a song. Check it out. Let me know what you think. Easy, straightforward. You know how we get down the channel, right? So as always, man, make sure you guys like, share, comment, subscribe, tell a friend, tell a friend about your boy. Humbly appreciate it. We're still on our road to 1,000, 100,000. We already got 1,000. 100,000 subs, baby. Right, We're going to get there with your help, man. And of course, if you rock with Meyer, his Instagram, and his links will be in the description below. Also for the original song, if you want to hear it without my talking over and everything like that, man. But let's check out Meyer. The song is called Delilah. All right. Cute kid. All right. So let's get into it, man. I am sick and tired of mm. hearing from other people that you're cheating on me. Ooh. Do you know how long Tough. our relationship has been? Four years. And you got me pregnant, too. Mm. Mm. I knew that people were coming on that. Oh, man, this is giving me some some old, old school vibe, man. Like we about to sit on the couch at the hood of a mom dude's house. He got some good cadence, man. It was a pleasure. I push on me, I was a pleasure. I ran away, holy clear. Bet you were even the skills. My written or higher material. Go, I feel so powered now. Open up my phone call. I can tell I've been crazy. Show me five times. Give me less space. I got you now. I'm ready to play this card to the chase. Stay from a god, you know you're bowed. Nothing about for stopping now. Watching the niggas diss each other while I'm stacking my dollars. Yeah, right. Let them diss. We're going to stack our money. Yeah. Hey man, this beat is so nice, man. It's so refreshing. Shiesty. Oh, ooh, uh. I ain't no no cap. I've had phone calls like it before in my life. I'm 36. All right, I've been around the block a little bit. I got a little experience on you know certain things. I've I've had phone calls like it before, not to work, but I got voice voicemails like it. But hey, man, my s s refresh. The cadence is great. The cadence is great. I was in there like, man, when is he gonna take a breath? Or anything like that. The the beat. I enjoy it so much because it's such like it was like a retro feeling beat. You know what I'm saying? It was that kind of beat that like you get back in the old school like vibe days. You know what I'm saying? I always talked about like, you know, when you uh back in the day, you got mom dudes, you sit on the couch, you know what I'm saying? It's like the you got the radio playing, you about to wake up on a Saturday morning because she about to have you do chores. It's like it's one of those, you know what I'm saying? That beat sent me to like the movie friday it, it feel like it would fit movie you know what i'm saying can you understand like that whole premise of like that atmosphere in the movie friday man it just like old ice cube like you know that woke up early in the morning crack of dawn you know what i'm saying it's yeah that was great but then the canes i always I always enjoy music that has some type of story element to it. it's not just somebody coming in and just rapping their head off, just being the most lyrical machine they pops it can be, doing quadruple entendres and everything like that. Stuff that is just like blowing your mind. I'm always I'm always cool when it's just when it's a bad music, when it's chill, it's not too much. It's just it's right to the point, but it's a story. When anytime an artist gets in music, and I always say the best way to grab someone is be relatable. All right. If you can relate to them, 
if you can do something that triggers something in their brain that they're listening to, that they can paint them or substitute them into that scenario, it's a winning formula. You can never go wrong when you're doing music, when you're speaking on real stuff and your life experiences, because it's not a lie. You ain't got what you, people can, but I'm just saying when it's, it's, it comes easy to you. That's why I always say hardest thing to do is keeping up with a lie. The truth is easy to remember because it's the truth, right? So when you're just speaking on your life or you're speaking on circumstances or situations you've been in, you can't go wrong with it, man. Like the girl coming on the voicemail, that was a dope little touch, man, with the whole story aspect. And I'm proud. I'm like, ooh, I felt that. I've had those calls before from like bitter people when she wasn't really, you know what I'm saying? She just wanted to keep somebody around or wanted me to feel away. So immediately I'm grabbed. You know what I'm saying? And then you come in with the bars and lyric and it's a vibe. It ain't over talk. You ain't going super fast like Twister and just rapping your head off. And I'm like, man, I'm getting a headache right now. It's 10 at night. I can't deal with it. It just makes you bop, man. You just alone for the ride. You know what I'm saying? It's just like, hey, Meyer, Delilah, I like it. I like it, man. Um, I hope you got some more music to check out too. I see it says 190 Beats and Meyer. So whoever, 190 Beats, if you did that beat, man, salute to you. Fantastic. I like the beat. That's, that's tough. Like, that's the, that's the main ask. Before you even get to the lyrics, nine times out of ten, what people um, grab their attention from is the beat. How does it make them feel? I mean, you got acapella where people just go in with a story if you just want to hear, you know what I'm saying? But the beat. You got a good beat. It's like we always say, nine tenths of a good song is beat selection. You pick a good beat, you can go. The beat trash, people really tune out. It's a good beat, man. So, Meyer. Uh, send my best to 190 beats, man. Tell them tough, tough, man. But that's Meyer with Delilah, man. Cute kid. You feel me? Everybody, everybody. I should have known it'd be like a retro style song, man, when you got like a baby photo in there. You know what I'm saying? You got baby photo as like your, your, your thumbnail or like your, your track title or the cover art. I'm like, yeah, we're going back in town. We're going to learn a little bit something about my man. You dig? So as always, man, if y'all rocking with the music, man, y'all like Meyer, I want to see what else he got. Of course, his information will be linked in the comments. Uh, description as well too, man. So just make sure you tap in with him, check him out, let him know, check out other stuff he got on. And uh, if it's something that's up your alley, man, you know what I'm saying? Make sure you give it a couple spins. I I, hmm, I can vouch for it. I like it. One song. That's what I like. I like one song, one song. It'll get saved to the playlist. You dig? So as always, man, until next time, and it will be soon. It's your boy SGFL, man. Louisville, stand up. We in the building. You're...